Hi guys, welcome back to Jones News, your news provider. Prominent businessman threatens police to get him transferred. Please remember, subscribe, like, share, and leave a comment. The trial of businessman Michael Issa, who is charged with resisting arrest and the use of indecent language, started in the St. James Parish Court on Monday with Detective Michael Chisholm giving evidence. However, the desire of the prosecution to have the contentious station diary brought in evidence resulted in the case being adjourned until June 1, 2022. When the case was called up, it was stood down for two in the afternoon as a result of the late disclosure of a statement to Easter's attorney, Michael Hemmings. The alleged copy of the statement served is in relation to the negligent loss of Easter's licensed firearm. Hemmings had requested the original statement, which led to the delay. However, when the case finally got underway in the afternoon, Detective Chisholm outlined a dramatic sequence of events that led to the charges of indecent language, abusive language, and resisting arrest being laid against Issa. According to Detective Chisholm, a distraught Issa showed up at the Freeport station on December 17 at 2 p.m. to report his firearm missing, which led to the immediate commencement of an investigation. On December 19, Issa contacted Detective Chisholm by way of a phone text message to inform him that the weapon was found. Issa was told to take the weapon in for testing at a government lab. The police reportedly did not hear from Issa again despite several messages left. When Issa was finally reached, he allegedly told Detective Chisholm that he should speak to Gordon Brown, his attorney, personal friend and advisor concerning anything having to do with the firearm. Detective Chisholm told the court that on January 13, 2022, Issa and his lawyer showed up at the police station for reasons unrelated to the firearm. The men were confronted, and Brown allegedly told Issa in the presence of Detective Chisholm and another police that the police can't lock him up, and hurriedly walked away when an alarm was made by Detective Chisholm. The police caught up with the men at which point Issa reportedly heard expletives and other abusive languages, and made mention of having Detective Chisholm transferred to another parish. Issa was charged with three offences, and the negligent loss of a firearm. Brown was also warned for prosecution in relation to perverting the course of justice whilst the police performed their duty. The firearm was taken, sealed, labelled and sent to the lab for testing. Issa was arrested and charged with the negligent loss of firearm, resisting arrest, abusive language and indecent language when he went to the police station hours after his stepson was allegedly abducted and killed to report his licensed firearm missing, the gun, which was said to have gone missing on December 17, 2021, and is unrelated to the child's death, was later found and the related charges dismissed. Gabriel, who was autistic, was found with his throat slashed, and his body slumped on the back seat of his mother's car, shortly after she told police, assailants dragged her from her car and drove away with her child in it. So guys, we're just going to take a few minutes, my sidekick and I, to just look at the two, Jamaica. Richie, welcome back. Blessings. Well, over the years, we have now noticed that there is this thing on the island with the brown skin privilege slash white are as how we grew up and call them high color. Now, because of how... Is that just the brown skin also, you know, the name? Yeah, the name and the skin. Mm -hmm. the, the, the two of them go together. Mm -hmm. Now, what happened now is that when 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 you grow up, there's this way how them always teach you, without teaching you, how to view people who are lighter than you. So from they open them out, you think them bright. Mm -hmm. From you see them and them brown, you think them good looking. From they hear straight, as we then say, a pretty hair, which simply means a few one ugly then you know. Mm -hmm. And if they are high color, it means a few one low, kind opposite a higher low. And it has always been you that remember, way. You remember, hold on. As a child growing up, if you look certain ways, you're ugly like a dopey. Yeah, man. Are you black like a what? Yeah, yeah. Say. yeah man. You're, you're, just, you're black like a sin. They, they call mm. it alpha or something. They, there was always this negative connotation that had been added to the, 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 the black skin. And it was something that was handed down from colonial days. How the slave master would treat, in, so the treat them. Right. Inferior. So then walk come home. Feeling inferior, believing that they are inferior. Mm -hmm. So them just look up to the brown and the white skinned man. I, because, it, because growing up, you know, the Issa mm -hmm. name and the Stuart name, you know, Sandals. Yeah, man. And, and the 
Amars and and the Matalans. Yes, and the and, um, and we, Samir we could Yunis. Go. When the name again? Uh, Samir Yunis, Yunis man. Them people, yes. yes. Marzuka. So, yes. And the list goes on. Right. Well, uh, quite a few of them. They have always been treated differently. Yes. Because so, looking back at this case, if I want a regular man to go into the station and go tell the police them bad word the way he tell them, I walk away from the police. And here, I have liars. They can't lock you up. Them, 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 are, them are pepper spray, man. They are pepper spray. Something. I want to lick and box and kick when you get. Right. So at the same time now, a man know, even though, you know, I may have to say big up to a detective who... Maintain this car. And not only that, and decide, say, listen, me prosecute. Me not look no friend. Yeah, me prosecute. Because it did happen to one man where we not go call his name some years ago, you know. Mm-hmm. With, with some ticket, you know. Mm-hmm. And so, so with, I see him kind of brown skin man, them, you know. Mm-hmm. Now, what end up happening now, you know, is that on this island, you see, you find so the lighter skin people them get good treatment mm-hmm. and then treat them in, pa, pa, in, 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 with, 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 with certain things where we are prejudiced on this island when, you're, when your skin black or you're from a certain family. Even if you go to the bank and get a loan, I see them thing. They want your, your, all your dead grandparents right. to dig up. And they want, they, right. when, and, when they walk into the bank, Doors open. Yeah, man. If you're giant land, land, like all in a COVID time, and you're giant so online, when them walk up, you know, them just a walk up and then all of a sudden, you hear security say, no, man, him, 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 him call from morning. Yeah, got you, sir. Mm-hmm. And them, them just fly door. They're not making touchy. And you walk past a queue in a bank, too. And it happens everywhere. And, and then they talking know, loudest. They know the power that they wield. You know what I'm saying? I'll get you transferred. I'll get you transferred. Because at the same time, I have direct numbers to people in parliament. Yeah. Listen to me. The boy, you know boy, you don't talking know to yourself. Boy? And, and I saw them behave. Yeah. Because them, them are the type of man them, where them lean back in. And them said, what are, what are those boys down there doing? And the big people, they matter about, you know. Mm-hmm. People were all on them too, you know. But the boys. Because I saw them grow them. Mm-hmm. No, it, it really yes, so it really really bad for no say we get bad treatment out here, and if we got a foreign, I see thing I go happen because we're not nobody. So in a few one country, mm-hmm. we're not nobody, and if we got a foreign, we're not nobody mm-hmm. because I see. So him where thing. where do we belong? Because where do we get our rights? We have to turn here and demand it because I yes, so I feel you know the thing about it, you know, if we're gonna say each time you have you have certain things, you have gonna left here. Mm-hmm. So who stays here? Because if you go somewhere else, you're a second class citizen. You know how much people they are firing right now will listen to this program and listen to other programs and would love to come back home and I because of crime. Mm-hmm. And the reason why crime can't fix on the island, yeah, I see them kind of something where people, instead of them fix it, they see something happen, yeah, they say, me just a try left your fast, you know. They not decide yeah, to listen to yeah, fix with Yeah, but sometimes they try to fix it and it don't work, so. Yeah. So people get discouraged. Yeah, man, me know. Frustrated. But at the same time, over and over, you have to try. But when we go right back to this with the, the brown skin privilege, no, me understand why so much people are bleach. Mm. I try to bleach themselves to privilege. No work. You have, you have a name It not work because at the same time, you people have have a understand so when you come in a station, and your bleach out, them not treat you like one of them brown because skin man that they say, a scammer that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know only that. That is not the only thing. If you're, if you're wanted, you wouldn't say, have bleached complexion. Yes, man. So my child change your identity. Yo, keep that brother there right there so we can look for him good enough. Okay? You know what I'm saying? Look like so as so do. Mm-hmm. So, it, it, it really bad for no say. In this day and age, we don't have any rights. Right. And we are still here being treated in the same manner. And that's still a colonial thing because still we treated are still... As slaves. Tre- because at the same time, we will always be treated like that until the laws are changed. Because we still are work with the colonial man, Lawe and Lefia, give you know. We're too lazy for even right we own. Yeah, but, but the ordinary man like we can go in the right. You're still the same brown skin man them who yeah, but, sponsor the politics in an election. Yeah, because then decide who stay in there. Exactly. exactly. So listen, I'm going to move those boys out there. Uh-huh. So, so what do we so, do? So when they did that, they must say, listen to me. I'm going to have a friend there, you see. I was just on beachfront property that we want to buy. We're going to get those boys off. Scrape off those squatters off her. Kill some of them, man. Get rid of them. We don't want to see them there. And that does not happen. Okay, Mike Henry. No call him on name on this thing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, people, we'll get Mr. Natural. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
That's this man so excited at me and I talk like Mike Henry. Uh, not Mike Henry would say that, you know, he's just speaking like how Mike Henry would speak. So before me get myself in a more trouble, let me jump off of this. I will leave no comments. Pick up yourself, Mike Henry. You know, you have a good one, sir. <laughs> make a jump off of these people. <laughs> I'm not in the day. Michelle Jones. <laughs> Respect and blessings every time.